Hello, welcome to the third attempt at recording Dr. Langstov, the Tiger, and the Terribly Cursed Emerald, a whirlwind heist. Um, the previous two attempts, the first one, uh, I did not record audio, and the second one, I became stuck. So, the first gameplay was pretty fun, but I feel like the audio made it better, so I had to come back and record it, and then... Obviously, I was stuck in a second, or I've discovered something new, and I believe fit the game more entertaining. Okay, two minutes. This is your two minutes. So the intro crew is ready. So we get the orchestra is ready, please. We have a 40 yes. lantern in the ballroom. Can we get somebody on that as soon as possible? Okay, just waiting for a go from Cairo. Do you have anybody? I just need a pencil. No, they've gone too. Alright, okay, no problem. One minute. Break a leg, everybody. Positions, please. Performance 237, beginning in 3, 2, 1. Let's go. Check, check, hello? It's on? Hello? Okay. Uh, so, uh, a deer come to me right now about a parrots. A parrots, uh, they are very interesting birds, very colorful birds. They talk, they repeat what they hear. A parrot repeat what he hears. It's a very interesting idea. I take this concept for game. I make a parrot character. He is, repeats what he hear from the player. So the player say something, the parrot repeat. It's a great idea for a game. I'm going to go pitch it to Michael. Right now, I'll be right back to tell the result from my pitch to Michael. And Michael said he don't like my idea. He said he don't like a parrot idea. Oh, oh, he don't like it. It is my strongest idea. <laughs> Give me a gun. Oh, fuck. Ow. Son of a bitch. He had taken my heart. He had, Michael had taken my heart. So, that was the parrot game concept. One second, please. Hold, hold your first position. There's somebody at the door. Uh, yeah, I know. Okay, one second. Can we get a precise location on the player, please? So There's two of them. The right. Okay. Hi. So this is this is so this is a bit um this is a bit awkward. I think it's probably best if we're just really honest with each other. It's uh, it yeah it's 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 a bit awkward. Um, the thing is, the game you've just downloaded, somebody is playing it right now, so you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't play it. I'm, I'm really sorry. Yeah, this is, uh, yeah, this is quite inconvenient. I don't know, I don't know why this keeps happening. Sorry, we're generally quite organised. You should come inside, I'll explain. Uh, just through here. Here's the thing. The game's live, which makes it impossible to to insert you. And also, it's 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 just quite difficult now for you to leave. But I think it's okay. I I I, I know I, I know what to do. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and call publicity and liaisons, and we should be able to take you to the green room. All right. If you just wait here, uh, and yeah, we'll be able to get you in. All right. Let me just let me just find the number here. Okay. It's ringing. Oh, they hung up. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm gonna try that again. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Uh, okay, let's see. Da, 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 da. I'm sorry, I know, I know we've both got better things to be doing with our lives. Okay, oh, I know what's going on. We've got um, something of a strike sort of situation emerging. Yeah, we've, we've become quite understaffed. Actually, you wouldn't um, mind doing me a favor, would you? Come, come through here. I could really, I could, I could really use your help. Okay, so as you can see, 
But if you'd rather, if you'd rather wait here, I, I could just let you know when we're ready for you. There's another person resigning. There's a... It's, it's just, you know, why miss out on this opportunity, right? Very few players get to visit here. Uh, except the last audio cue. All right. All right, state your name. My name is My name is Terry. All right, Terry. So, you're playing the role of a giant cucumber. You're being chased by lawn garden people. So, go ahead. Let me hear what you got. Okay. Here we go. Hey, I'm a giant cucumber. Check me out. I'm a giant cucumber. All right, that's pretty good. Can you do that? Can you be a little more, a little scareder? A little scareder, please. Okay. Oh, man, I'm a giant cucumber. I'm so scared. Oh, jeez, check me out. I'm a giant cucumber. All right, that's pretty good. Next. All right. Um... You're playing the part of, you're recording for the part of uh, a giant garden person who's chasing a huge cucumber. State your name and go ahead and give me a, go ahead and give me a, an audition. Uh, my name's, my name's Willie. And here we go. I'm a, I'm a giant garden person. I'm chasing a cucumber. Come, in, come on back and get me. Come on and get you. Here I'm coming to get you. I'm a giant lawn or garden character. My name's, my name's Willie. All right, that's pretty good. Not bad. We'll, we'll let, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll let you know. Next. All right, um, state your name. Oh, my name's Little Tommy. All right, Little Tommy, you're going to be auditioning for the part of the giant planet. So you're going to be a whole planet that's in outer space, and you're going to just be getting chased by a bunch of pickles, cucumbers, all kinds of stuff like that that are real big. So go ahead, let's hear it. Okay, um, oh no, I'm a giant planet. Oh jeez, check me out, look at me, I'm a whole planet. I'm getting chased by a bunch of cucumbers and pickles and all that stuff. Oh no, my name's Little Tommy. I hope I hope I, I hope I get this part. I'm really hoping I could get. I, I really need this money. Whoa, that was an incredible audition, little guy. All right, well, we'll be in touch. Jenny, you got all this recorded? All right, put this in Michael's office. This is one of per 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 Perrier's games. Yeah, Pierre. I'm getting sick of this shit. So, uh, I believe we are getting an insight on why they quit because this just seems terrible. Just an awful place. Um, there's more letter of resignations as well as more collectors. Uh, I believe there was three pencils of so one, two, three, as well as two coins. So this seems to be perhaps side missions in this game. Hopefully we can complete them. On to the next area. The thing is, our entire weather department and half the wildlife crew is just up to the left before we could even begin this morning. And it's all super simple. It's mostly buttons. You like buttons, right? And you'll be able to play the game as soon as whoever is in there at the moment is finished. Promise. Your help? Oh, this is fantastic. Okay, this way. Yeah, the lighting department's right through here. Hmm. Yeah. Could we 
You're spoiling some of the magic, you know. It feels a bit like cheating, but, you know, it's okay. You carry on. You do whatever you need to do. Oh no, that's, uh, yep, that's the broom. Could you get, oh, that was an adventure. Okay, so if you could just head down the stairs there, yeah? We have a job to do. Plenty of other tables for you. Don't, don't worry about the strike. It's, we'll, we'll get through it. Ah, the scary pencils. The scary pencils are coming to attack me. The scary pencils are coming to attack me. What do I do? Well, I, do, I tell you one thing. You've got to run as fast as you can to the hills. Uh, you got to take off of your clothes. Uh, you got to run in the hills. Uh, the scary pencils are coming to attack. That's the scene of the first act of the game. That's the scene of the first act of the game. Why won't anyone take my idea? It's just a trying to make a game over here. Oh, oh, uh, rejection is so hard to take. It uh, hurts me. Oh, the pencils, they attack. You are running for the hills. You take off all of your clothes. It's such an easy concept. It's such an easy game concept. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. They think they know all the best ideas for the game. I know the good ideas for the game. I want to have a, a pencil attack. You write with the pencils. But they now attack you. You run for the hills. Oh, <laughs> you up, up again, huh? Right. First things first, could you bring up the lights? Thank you so much. Because, you know, we can't have people playing in the dark. Or they'll fall over. And it, you know, they could die. See that lever? It sets the sunset off. We got the reflections in the lake looking. They're sort of great. I don't know. Um. Could you pull the lever? Oh my god, that switch literally says unknown and you thought it'd be a good idea to flick it? Who knows what it does? I don't even know if we should be concerned. I still need you to pull the lighting lever though. That, that would be ideal. Yeah, just now. It's the bigger one. Maybe not do that, please. The lighting department spent at least an afternoon on that. They'd be really unhappy if they were, you know, still here. Blinking on in the windows of the mansion, up past the ornamental ponds. Oh, it's pretty magical, really. Okay, now we need to attack them with a tiger. It, it, it's a heist game. The player's playing a big heist. I, I don't want to spoil it for you, but it, the tiger's very important. It's in the title. All right, into wildlife preparation. Just through the door. Don't, you don't have to be alarmed. It's not, it's not a real jungle. It's just a game. It's actually, it's just a room full of b bits of jungle. The difference is important, but I, I, I mean, I, I can understand the concern. I can't let you in there. Sorry, it's, it's very complicated. Health and safety. It's shelves, it's just, there's a lot of shelves. But look, 
we really need to attack the player with the tiger. It's very important. Not really sure how how shelves are the new shelves. So how has Pencils concept like okay, so this guy got the points and decided he was gonna come back. Oh shows You know hurt to my heart There's nobody Believe in me about am I serious? I'm a serious. Hmm. I'm a serious m gonna make of this game pencils. Oh, the scariest vessel of terror in the world is a pencil. The pencil's tack. You run it for the hills. <laughs> Why did they do it to me? Why did they do this to me? It's a good idea. It's a good idea. Oh, it's going to be a lost in the voids of the universe. Uh, mm. Oh, so upset. I hit the tables. Ow. Oh, oh, oh. Ow, I broke my pinky. Oh, oh, oh. Ow. Oh, the creative process. Oh, oh, oh. The creative processing of it tearing me apart. It tearing me apart. Oh, oh. oh. it's a, it's a week of twenty-five. Ah, <laughs> uh, the, uh, the pencils. They are a terrorist. They attack. You have to run for the hills. You take off all of your clothes. Each clothing item, it represent one point of power. You must lose your power points or the pencils will attack. Head up for the hills! Oh, so excited. Right, this is all, it's so safe. We'd usually have someone else do this, but they started striking right after one of them got. Well, that's not, well, uh, I shouldn't have. Just, just pull the lever and, and let's say, introduce the tiger to the level. <laughs> you should pull the tiger lever, really. Perfect, that went perfectly. Uh, there should be a red button nearby. It will just let the recovery crew know that the tiger's ready for pickup. It's the, it's the button. I think it's by the door to the weather room. We just can't leave the tiger in the level. Oh no, oh no, not that, not that door. There's a, look, there's a far more pressing concern in the room and it's growling. Look, the tiger's in. Uh, okay, pr press it again. Oh, thank goodness. The recovery crew are on the move. I wonder they might have joined the picket or gone to the union or been eaten by a tiger, you know. Okay, I'm, t I'm trying to work out where you're going to be most useful. I don't think we have anybody left in catwalks, do we? Oh, we do. Oh, great. Wow. Can't believe it. I guess weather control then. The door's just over there. You're doing, you're doing so great. There's not really, there's really not far to go. Pencils game. <laughs> what could go wrong? Do you see? My ideas are not a good. <laughs> the pencils attack. You are hiding for the hills. <laughs> what is so hard to get? What is so hard to understand? <laughs> the pencils attack. You run for the hills. You take off all the clothes. You hide in the bush. It is such a simple game. The game design is so simple. It's so. It's so angry. It makes me anger!
Oh, I hate this room. It hasn't been easy, you know. During our second performance, a pipe burst in here and flooded the whole garden level. The player got stuck on the, uh, on the roof of the summer house. All right, okay, the script calls for a storm. Let's make it rain. It's the red valve on the pipe next to the door. Gently. A lot of the story relies on there being a storm. It's, 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 a, it's a big part of Act 3. Listen, really, it's okay. Don't worry about what I told you about the fire. We've had 235 non-fatal performances since then. No, 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 too much. Okay, we're good. Uh, there's a button below the fan that sorts out the thunder and lightning. Could you do the lightning? It's a really... Oh! It might be wired up wrong, I'm sorry. That room gets back down. Now I think about it, it might have been... Oh no! There it is! There it goes! You've got a picture of the building lit up by these big flashes of lightning. It's really imposing. The set's massive. Oh! Speaking of... The player has apparently entered the mansion through the orangery and is... <sighs> They're going to use the lift. Okay, that's okay. We can do this. We're right here. This way. Actually, wait. Hang on a second. This is really important. Behind this door is the closest the player ever passes backstage. They'll be right behind a wall. And I, I don't know what the wall's made of, but I do know that it's phenomenally cheap. So, it's going to have to be very quiet. Okay. Just down the steps. Yeah, that's good. That's the mansion in there. I didn't want to tell you, but we actually lost the player for a minute earlier. I mean, I mean, they're back now. It's fine. We're good. But they, they completely vanished for a bit. Which, thinking about it, might be a fairly good argument for not pressing the switch. Mark, unknown. In any case, here's what we need to do. The player's going to come down the corridor and call the lift. And once the doors open and they get inside, they're going to press the down button. When that happens, all you have to do is pull the lever on this side. This lift was always supposed to power itself, obviously. This is just a hangover from rehearsals that nobody got round to replacing. Besides, it's fine, it's fine. We've got plenty of time. And actually, no, wait, here he comes, here he comes. Shh, ow, eyes front, eyes front, eyes front. Wait for him. Ready? What are they doing? Why haven't they, why haven't they pressed the button? Did they hear us? Don't move. Pull the, pull the lever. Pull the lever now, please. What are you waiting for? Pull it. <sighs> You're breaking my heart. Okay, 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 fine. We'll just wait. We'll just wait, shall we? Oh, thank God. I'm moving. Oh, no idea what happened there. I think, I think, I think they, they can't have heard us. I hope they didn't hear us. They probably didn't hear us. At least they're on their way now. Actually, they're going to be very busy with the vault. You could start playing in the grounds. We just need to prep some pyrotechnics for the escape sequence and then you're good to go. There's a lift to the pyro workshop up the stairs. If we could just, uh, hurry along. Hey, it's me, little Timmy. I got the part. I'm hiding... <laughs> Pretzels all around the office. I'm gonna put pretzels in all the nooks and crannies of this place. Just kidding. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I don't wanna lose my job. <laughs> I'm Mike, I'm I'm little Tommy. Um I got the part as the planet, and I'm gonna be a planet. Hopefully the funding comes through. The financing for the game. They said they can't finance it, but they're gonna try anyways. I'm little Tommy, and I'm the role of the planet. Check me out. I'm going to be a planet in the game. Oh, Daisy. I'm going to place pretzels.
pretzels all over this building. Forget about it. Just kidding, I'm not doing that. I don't want to lose my work. <laughs> what do you think, I'm crazy? I wouldn't put pretzels anywhere. That's a surefire way to get fired from your voice job as a, pre as a planet. I'm a big old planet. I hear there's a, I hear there's a, a, a company party tomorrow night. I'm little Tommy. I'm going to be there. You can bet your bottom dollar on that. I'm going to go there and I'm going to really shake it up. I'm going to shake this place up once and for all by putting pretzels all over the every nook and cranny of that building. <laughs> Just kidding. No. Who do you think I am? A, a lunatic? I wouldn't do that. What kind of crazy person wants to get fired that bad? <laughs> I'm little Tommy. Look at me. I'm going to... I'm gonna, I, I don't know why they don't hurry up with the financing. Still waiting to record. Who boy, who baby? You gotta get a get a get a get a buckle on it. Get a buckle on it. That's my quote. That's what I tell everybody I know. Get a buckle on it. Get out of here. You know what I mean? Anyways, I don't know why I keep talking into this recording recorder. It's not like I got better stuff to do. I mean, it's not like I don't have better things to be doing. I got all kinds of stuff I got to do, such as hide pretzels all around the building. You know what I mean? I'm going to stuff them in every nook and cranny. <laughs> Just kidding. What kind of crazy idea came up with that idea? You know what I mean? All right. Well, so, so over and out. Little Timmy over and out. Let's write this down. Let's see. One, eight, six, six. Six, two. Six, eight. Two, four. Six, nine. out and missed out on a pretzel. Uh, I'm not really sure what the repercussions of that is going to be. Hopefully uh, not so too serious. random as if there is no objective but then at the same time it realizes that there is oh achievement in the shadows maybe it's an achievement That's really well drawn. Not sure why I cannot click on this. Oh my god. Are you okay?
Do you, do you, do you still have your ankles? Are they, are they in the correct uh, orientation? Okay, you're okay? You do? That's great. I'm so, I'm, oh God, I'm so sorry about that. I really, this is, well, this is the weather room, isn't it? Uh, right. Okay, listen. Since we can't reach the lift of Pyro, the only way back into the game is through, is through a department called High Concept Miscellaneous Interactions. Oh, I didn't want to have to do this to you. There's usually a lot of training involved. But I'll talk you through it. You'll be fine. We'll be fine. You brace yourself. Welcome to Miscellaneous Interactions. This is the department that controls... Well, it controls a lot of things. Locks and unlocked doors, interior lights, smoke machines, telephone calls, actor cues, laser lights, vault guards, tranquilizer dart strengths, you know, that kind of thing. But it's all just done with numbers. I, I don't know why. And, uh, and usually the operator's got this big... Um, you know, usually they know what they're doing, but I've got a manual here. I think we'll get through it. Right, in order to get started, you're going to want to press the number four. Just go right ahead, the number four. It should be on the left hand side. Uh, you know, you know, you know the number four, right? It's a, you know, four. Hold on, sir. It's a, it's like a, it's like an L shape with, with a short line through the, um, I can't believe what am I doing here? It's like an L with a short line through the bottom bit. It's, it's a four. Of four. Uh, yeah, I, uh, yeah. I don't think that light is a bad time. Uh, five, seven, two, one, two, one. Um, three. Ah. Okay. So what we did there, it turns out, was the wrong thing. Could you, um, could you press nine and then four and then and then one? Oh, I think we restarted it. It's all right, there's a page in the manual about this. Oh, I think you should probably get that. Listen, I know it's tempting to ignore problems that you've caused, but this is, this is really the worst time for that. Just come on, pick up the phone. Just come on, pick up the phone. No. They might actually be able to help. No. What, what, what did you just, that could have been very important. What did you, why did you, ah, I, I, it's all right. Okay, I found the right instructions. All right, I need you to press, the number nine. All right. Let's. Okay. Well, let's let's assume we've got nine sorted. All right. Okay. Five, two, one, four, four. Wait. No. Hit start to cancel that. And then a two. A six. Just ignore that. That's fine. Right. Seven, two, left. One, four. Two. Oh Christ! Please pick up the phone. Please. And talk to them this time. Oh, come on! Again? Is, is there. A, you did not know how to use the phone. Alright, back to the board. Hit these four numbers. Two, five, nine. Oh, I guess we don't need to bother with nine. Oh. 
that sound that I might have told you to ignore, it turns out that it, it, that's a very bad alarm. So I'm going to need you to just do a 180 right down the stairs, please, right down. Probably, I'd probably go a bit further. Move. Here's, here's good. Here's good. Great. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Okay, back, back, come on, back up the stairs. A bit faster than that, please. Just a bit, you know, just a bit faster. Come on, come on. All right, don't worry, don't worry. Actually, do worry a bit. Hit seven, four, then asterisk. Is there a fire below us right now? Is there, some, is there something on fire? Oh, there is, isn't there? I don't think, really, I don't think any of this room is supposed to be on fire. Please don't do what I think you're about to do. Please don't do it. Pick up the phone and put it to your ear like a normal person. Like a normal person who can answer a phone. No! <laughs> <laughs> you did what I think you didn't do. Why did you do it anyway? Why? Wait, hang on. We can, we can still fix this. We can. I, I need you to find a blue panel marked downpour. It's turned off, right? I found a way to activate a fail-safe lever to the left of the... Oh no, wait, on the right of the keypad. Right, not left. Those are the left. Uh, okay, when the downpour panel lights up, I'm gonna need you to pull it. When it lights up, not before. Any moment now. Players left the mansion. I think, I, I think we did it. I don't think it's supposed to still be raining, but you know, hey, come back down the stairs. Wait. You're, you're done here. You don't need to spend any more time in this room. You can forget about the whole thing. Well, you, you, you can try to forget about it. Whatever. This is it. You're done, sister. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You really helped out. We couldn't have made it through without you. We really couldn't have. Through here. Here we are again. So this is how it's going to work. You go in there. Just give me a moment. I will bring the lights up. And Dr. Langstock, the tiger, and the terribly cursed emerald. Enjoy it. Oh, don't tell me you're getting cold feet now. Anything, trust me, anything on the other side of that door is peanuts compared to what we've just gone through. It's great though, it's, uh, it's really good. Particularly the voice work. Some of the voice work is outstanding. I wonder what happens if I just don't... don't. It's really good, I can see Bafta sniffing all over this. It's really good, it'll probably win awards. Yeah, despite everything, it's really not bad. Thank you so much. What? Another player? You've got to be kidding me. You, I can't, I can't do this again. Okay, this is really awkward. The fact of the matter is, wait, hang on, where are you going? Right, so, look, I need to talk you... Okay, that's the lighting room. You need to put... Okay, fine, this is wildlife prep. No, hang on! This is... That, that's a... Hang on, there's a tiger in there! There's a tiger in there! That's... Uh, no, don't... Don't pull that! Wait, no! Oh! oh God.
there, so I suppose that that is the game. So, I guess I'll rate that a solid 8 or 7.5, 8. Um, it felt very fulfilling. Must have been about 20 30 minutes long. Um, there did seem to be a main quest as well as side quest in the pretzels, the tapes, and the coins. I'm not really sure that I collected all of them. But it seemed very, very entertaining. So, all that considered, I'll probably rate it 8.5 out of 10. I know I said 7.5, 8, but we thinking probably 8.5. Uh, very good uh, experience. So. Bravo, I really really enjoyed the uh, the little tapes that we picked up as well as the hunt for pretzels and coins the main story was good but I feel like the tapes and the side stuff was a little more entertaining which is why this isn't getting a 9 or a 10 so thank you for watching my video as always please like and subscribe